In the world of military tanks, the British Challenger II had a reputation for being nearly indestructible. That was until a fateful day in Ukraine. Today, we'll take you through the gripping story of the Challenger II's unexpected loss in the Battle of Robotine. The Challenger II, heavier and slower than its Western counterparts, had an unparalleled record it had never been lost to enemy fire and combat. Its legacy was built on the foundation of resilience. In December 2022, the United Kingdom donated 14 Challenger II tanks to Ukraine. This symbolic gesture marked the beginning of a new chapter in Ukraine's military capabilities. Fast forward to the Battle of Robotine, one of the most lethal battlefields in the world. Ukrainian forces, equipped with the newly acquired Challenger II tanks, were in the midst of a fierce struggle against Russia's elite 76th Guards Air Assault Division. A Ukrainian ambulance crew captured a shocking moment on video. A burning Challenger II disabled Ukrainian T-64 BV tanks and knocked out Humvee-style trucks. The apocalyptic conditions of Robotine were all too evident. Amidst the chaos, hope emerged. Despite the Challenger 2 catching fire, its crew miraculously survived. British Defense Secretary Grant, Shaps confirmed the crew's survival, though the circumstances differed among accounts. A crew member praised the Challenger 2 for its ability to engage targets at long range, calling it a sniper rifle compared to Soviet tanks. Its design prioritized crew survival, a stark contrast to Soviet doctrine. The loss of the Challenger II was attributed to Russian artillery fire. Other possibilities included anti-tank mines, kamikaze drones, or long-range anti-tank missiles. The Challenger II evolved from its predecessor, the Challenger I, and boasted advanced armor and weaponry. Its performance in the Gulf War and Iraq further solidified its reputation. The myth of invincible super tanks was dispelled over time, as history showed that no tank could withstand everything. The key to preserving tanks was to build fewer of them and minimize their exposure to combat. As Kiev considers the future, the question arises, will the UK send more refurbished Challenger 2S to Ukraine? With plans to upgrade existing Challengers, spare tanks may become available for donation. The loss of one Challenger 2 is a minor setback, but it underscores the relentless nature of warfare. The remaining Challenger 2S in Ukraine's arsenal will continue to play a pivotal role in their ongoing counteroffensive. The Challenger 2's legacy may have been challenged, but its spirit of resilience lives on. In the ever-evolving landscape of military technology, adaptability and determination remain the keys to survival thanks for watching